um, merchandise that YouTubers would sell. Like, let's say if I just wanted to give you guys merch, like that's what it was giving me. Twitter goes ham on this girl, to be honest with you. What's up? It's me, Mahogany G, back in with another video. So they clapped up my recal mob video, but you know that's cool because we're gonna get into this Instagrammer called Ari. So this Instagrammer, her name is Ari, and she is a influencer. She has 2.5 million followers on her IG, and she ended up wanting to sell some merchandise. Now I looked at the merchandise, and the merchandise ended up looking like. Um, merchandise that youtubers would sell like let's say if I just wanted to give you guys merch like that's what it was giving me Twitter goes ham on this girl to be honest with you she actually disabled her comments um, after people um, noticed that um, <laughs> she couldn't even sell 36 t-shirts three six three six t-shirts okay um, if you have a big following, I hate to say it, but big followers, big followings um, are mostly kids. You need to understand that. Half of social media is little kids with no time on their hands and they just end up being trolls or they just end up being followers of you. To be honest with you, I understand, you know what I'm saying? Um, looking at her Instagram, it's quite, you know, flowery, very fashionista. How I found out about this was, um, cosmetologian and that said the an influencer with 2.2.5 million subscribe 2.5 million followers couldn't sell 36 t-shirt and twitter goes twitter is not okay so um it says the twitter is freaking out that this influencer re followers you know she actually couldn't get um even half of her 2.0 million followers to get even just like a single shirt um that was quite sad um but understanding that she is an influencer and she needs to understand when you're selling things you have to know demographics you have to know your audience you have to know people that will buy your stuff because at the end of the day you can have like cutie pies numbers and have like zero comments um and those are like real followers those are not fake followers you know what i'm saying those are not like you know, computer generated followers, you know what I'm saying? So this one um, a Twitter user says, flawless and brown, I quote, the influencer bubble is burst. This young lady is well over 2 million followers and couldn't sell 36 t-shirts. Focusing on the genuine engagement and not followers cause they ain't buying a thing, Jesus Christ. So how I, guess everybody found out about this was because um she posted this um picture right here and then i'll put the uh, put the caption up here this is a long caption so i'm just gonna like skim through it it says it breaks my heart that i have to write this post releasing a brand blah 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 and for my photo shoot fly out photographers makeup artists blah da 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 um thank you to her best friend um she says in order for them to order and make my products even to keep working with them i had to sell at least 36 pieces so 36 is not too much you would think like you're pushing weight shawty wasn't even pushing cloth oh my gosh this is so sad at this point um you might have to look at your target audience my good sis y'all can read it yourselves but yeah ari mm. Even though Ari has an L in this, I have to say this is a W because you know why she got, she went completely viral, okay? To be honest with you, um, I didn't even know Ari. Twitter didn't even know Ari like that, just except for her like 2.5 million followers. Actually ended up, um, Wale actually ended up in these thread right here. He ended up in the thread saying, and I quote, me when my music drops and I look and I look at three million people like sad face and he actually did respond to one of his fans and stuff like that so that was quite cool to be honest with you and um, people are just going ham on Twitter like to be honest with you I'm just looking at all these um, 
you know, these Twitter posts. I'm just gonna post them. I'm going to post them up so you guys can see it. But. This is so, so sad. Um, and the other, another Twitter user, I have to say, during this um, post on uh, Cosmetologian said, here we go. His name is Jack Appleby, and he says, an influencer with 2.6 million followers launches her fashion brand, and now she says she fails to sell she fails to sell more than 36 units and then it says um i'm not surprised but it's also crazy i couldn't sell 36 units shawnee couldn't even sell 36 units this is this is crazy i have to say when you have an l you use it to your advantage because to be honest with you this l is definitely a win you may not think l's are wins but nowadays in social media l's are wins if you go viral on an l Trust me, everybody wants to like be like, who the hell is this chick? She got an L. Laugh, troll. It says, um, and Jack Appleby actually made sense. He said, I can't, okay, no, it says, look at her feed versus her product line. These aren't even close to the same aesthetic. If you can't imagine her wearing any of these, why would her followers? And it shows a picture of her, um, her line, like, not her, her thread through her Instagram, and then it shows her line. Like I said, this line shows me that she just wanted to put just something printed on a t-shirt and says, Ari, and that's it. She didn't really put too much back behind it. And then I seen another Twitter user saying that you, if you wanna be a fashion designer, you have to learn how to sew this, that, and the third. To be honest with you, no, you don't have to. You don't see Fashion Nova business um, saying, ooh, you know, we just cut and stitch, we just did everything. I'm pretty sure Fashion Nova, all they did was take some Chinese products all the way from China and then just like market it over there. And look at them. They're like a million or billion dollar industry now. You know what I'm saying? So like, to be honest with you, I don't think you need too much to like be a fashion designer nowadays. You just need a uh, backing. Also, you just need enough designs where people want to buy it. And knowing your target audience and all these things that's what people kind of forget is if you're going to buy something do the research okay you just can't go you just can't go up and just buy things you just can't go up and buy things and then just you know okay I'm just gonna sell it to you guys that's it no backing no advertisement no anything like that she did actually do a sneak peek of her she did do a sneak peek a post about her um her clothes and stuff like that um, you know, it was kind of iffy because even though her engagement like had comments, it had likes, it's sad to say that her post about her saying that she couldn't sell 36 t-shirts had 35k likes and none of them, none of those likes were actually buying her, her product. So, um, definitely wins at, at the end of this, she still wins. 
regardless. 2.5 million followers that she has, yeah? Mm. And I'm just going off on this Twitter rant, yeah? Everybody just going off on her, you know what I'm saying? Giving their opinion and everything like that. Even Wale jumping in, you know what I'm saying? Let me just give a little intake on Wale. I'm just gonna jump on Wale real quick, okay? Wale, when he posted that comment saying, when you have three point, when you have three million followers and your um, sales don't look the same, something's not clicking with Wale either. And just as Ari, something's not clicking with her brand either. I understand her. I be putting out videos and nobody be watching my videos and I have 2K followers. You know, some people follow you for different reasons. Some, be, some people follow you because maybe because you they like your hair. Some people follow you maybe because they like your clothes. Maybe they follow you and they have no money in their bank. These people follow you and they're little kids. These little kids don't have credit cards. These, peop these little kids don't have money, but they follow you and you have 2 point million followers. You know what I'm saying? So how do you feel about this? Tell me what you guys think about Ari not selling at least three, six units of clothes. That's all she had to like sell. I mean, you see other um, businesses have to sell more just to break even. But um, what do you guys think about this? I so actually guys, I'm actually doing a fashion channel. So if you guys want to see more fashion and all those things like that i will be putting it down in the designer box below so you guys can go and check that out i'm i will be having a fashion channel so i can just like you know have my reaction and then have my fashion channel so like we can like you know separate it separate don't forget to subscribe follow me on all my social media i'm trying to get to two million too follow my social media so you can help me get out of my mom's house you know sorry if you're watching this you are gonna make it regardless. Um, you have a lot of influence, you know what I'm saying? Regardless if you see the trolls, um, you know, badger you and all those things like that, you're still gonna make it regardless. So me just posting is not gonna hurt your brand, um, but actually just teach you a lesson on what to do. Um, Cause we all learn from mistakes uh, that we do. So right now she's just learning from her mistakes. So at the end of the day, that's what I'm just so here's a quick update she actually had to reword her statement in a new an IG post but me looking back on her Instagram to look back at what she has updated her subscriber count has doubled and now looking at the post that she has posted it seems that she had to sell 36 products of each of the seven different products that she had and in total she had to sell 260 oh 52 pieces and now and she's definitely explaining in this post that she has learned a lot from other people's opinions on the internet and that's all you need to actually um you know remind yourself like yes this is a mistake but yes i can learn from it and that's what this post was saying after she have updated it so not only that but i do truly respect her um even after the trolls were like trolling her on twitter not only that her follower count just jumped and um yeah so don't forget to subscribe comment like um and tell me if you want more videos like this and all right see you later see you in the next video